Right, where are we going? Skull Caves. Does this just loop us back around? Okay, right, that was a very exciting little hole to uh, have a play in. That's Volcanic Activity. I'm just trying to explore. Man, I feel, God, like so much more confident knowing that the big guy is dead. Even if he does respawn. Like, you know, I've got a little bit of time. Or I think maybe just even knowing that I can kill him. That me with my, my wits and my mitts, um, I can stab him up. Which maybe isn't how you should be playing this game. You should be super spooked, living in harmony with nature. Exactly. You should be living in harmony with nature! <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, but... No, wait. We are killing in harmony with nature. Skull Cave is that way. Let's go this way. Although, actually, the more we travel, the more likely we are to find something else spooky. Oh, what the fuck is that? Is that a plant? Or is that a monster? Oh, it's just, it's just plants. It's just plants. Why are you guys getting so spooked? Oh, there's crabs. Hello. <laughs> Hello, crabs. Can I kill him? Oh, that feels good. Get out of here. <laughs> it's just... There's no pretense. Like, I am a stone... A stone cold killer. Uh, okay. Lot of crabs in here. What is that? Is that gold? Ooh. <gasps> oh my god, that was something that was something that we haven't seen before. What is that? Crystalline sulfur. Oh my god, don't tell me. Oh, it's magnetite. <laughs> I was like, wait, is have we found the new biome? Where the new boys live. Uh, lithium. God, this is like good on resources anyway. Oh, in full. Hey, crabs, crabos. Look at this. Uh, oh, the solar thing. Um, crystalline sulfur, the gold. Yeah, fuck. We, we'll put the stuff in for now and then worry about it later. Arm cube, you can go in there. Sure. Have a drink. Have a bite to eat. God, the crabs are really f coming out to play. Oh, they're like crime scene investigators. Hello, hello, hello. We heard about a hit and run in the area. Oh, easy, buddy. Ah, oh, he's holding on to a sea baby. Blood crawler. Ugh. Ugh. Man, I didn't feel bad about... Oh, actually, these guys, I guess they're... Attacking in self-defense. I did attack first. Oh, buddy. I don't think we've got meds on us either. Oh, no, we do. How's the heal? Wow, okay, maybe we shouldn't have gone quite so ham. Uh... That is magnetite. Although, you know what? Magnetite. Gonna need some. Oh, God, guys, like, don't hold on to my baby. Wow, we're getting good amounts of this. I'm gonna guess that we're gonna need, like, six short term. Because there was a whole load of resources. Actually, wait, didn't I need to make something? So, what is making that noise? Is it you? No, there's something weirder. <laughs> Just pay attention to the game! Your inventory's full! Break. Oh, wow. That was weird. There was a... stone in the thing. Uh... Uh... Gel sex. Okay, we've got five. If I can get, like, a little bit more... 
I'll be happy. Man, maybe we even put like a fucking beacon down in here. So we know where to come more easily. <gasps> okay, well that's what was making the noise. That fucking... Makes me... Not as having a fun time. Okay, there's like a little bit over here. Please don't spider my sea baby. Um, out. Thank you. Just what I wanted. Um, I guess we could go kill that guy. I don't think we should. <laughs> I do. Oh, they, those guys don't really hurt very much. I guess they're infecting me. But that is... that's okay. So we... oh, do you want to eat some gel? Ouch. They're just having like a little bit of blood. You know, we're giving back to the community. Alright, chomp. Oh, oh, shit! I said I wasn't going to kill you! Uh, I will zap you. Did that work? I hope so. God, you took like a big fucking bite out of me. I feel like that. That is crime. That is sea crime. And you made sea baby cry. Let's keep going and we'll just try and avoid him. Um, I actually kind of want to check to see what those like stony outcrops are. Silver. Oh, that makes sense. Is he coming? Oh, is it all just silver? Okay, fine. I thought they were different. Oh, maybe you're different. Titanium. Sure. Oh my god, he like really super wants to like tussle. Oh man. The temptation is rising ever since he bit Sea Baby and made Sea Baby cry. You know, he's used to being like the big bully in the area. Um, I guess he's a baby as well. Oh, I don't know. It's a moral quandary. I hear you. I will shoot. Oh, uh, if that had have hit, I would have done it. I would have gone for it. Maybe we can, like, just drive him off with a couple of little stabs. Oh. Uh. Wow. Maybe we can actually wait. It'll take forever for us to kill this thing without... Wow, I think the tail. His tail just isn't even an entity. It's only, like, the very front section. Okay. Uh, you made this happen. Two minutes and 54 seconds of absolute savagery later. Oh man, I do actually, I kind of think that... Killing these guys... Oh, there he goes. Like, it does remove a bit of, like, the magic from the world. It's like, oh, the last of the dragons is dead, sort of thing. That's assuming they don't respawn. If they respawn, then, um, fucking, I bought myself, like, ten minutes of fun exploration time. Man, still not met Nickel. But in turn, man, got nothing to worry about. <laughs> Just love those guys. I want to set up a base near them so I can so I can hear them talk to me every now and again because I think that is my favorite thing about this game. After Sea Baby, who fills me with joy, and punching stuff with Fisto, which is also amazing. Oh, is that a secret fucking base? Oh. What is this? Oh man, I'm so glad we didn't try and drive Sea Baby in here. Because we definitely would have died. What the fuck is going on here? Wow, I feel like I'm in Skyrim or something all of a sudden. Yeah. Uh. Wow, we actually really dinged up. If there's spiders... Oh god, I should probably be ready for spiders. Um, not spiders. Crabos. Oh! Monsieur! It's a teleporter! But... How do I activate you? Before... I had to put like an energon cube somewhere. Okay. How many beacons have we got? Do we put one in the ship? This might be worth like noting down for later. Oh, it's because I don't actually have the cube on me. I've got a cube back in my thing. Does something have to like pop up? Oh god, okay, don't goof around. 
Okay, cool. Right, we've got all the good stuff in Sea Baby. Please don't explode, Sea Baby. That would make me sad. Um, I'll take a ruby. Do we even want rubies anymore? I feel like we kind of we're a bit like rubied out these days. Uh, this must be like just a receiving gate rather than a going somewhere gate. I I, I must have found like the back back end of it. I found the exit pipe, the old poop pipe. And that's not so good. God, this is like a bit of a janky place. Well. What we'll do, I'll put a beacon here anyway, because apparently now we're really good at games and we just put beacons everywhere. Poop gate. Okay, right, we've got poop gate. Are you? No, you're just regular stuff. Uh, poop gate. Oh, actually, man, maybe like getting this gel, because I can't eat it for like negligible stuff, but I think we're going to need that for the. Great adventure home. Oh, we've got like a uh, like a nutty bar. <gasps> Skull. Do you need to be scanned? Nah. <laughs> Let's just add you to the list. Oh wait, I should probably scan you before I kill you. Oh wait, are you already dead? Uh, wow, man, just, you fucked up. Um, did you not see the other guy get super cut up? What is this? I guess it's just like coral or something. Okay, man, the gun, knife combo, perfect. Because I'm guessing while you're inside the, like the, area of it, nothing can come and, like, spooky spook up on you. God, like, this place feels like a nice place to be. Uh, ignore the crabs and the bitey boys, but you get to hear the song of the sea, guys. Um, right, okay, skull caves. <laughs> Why are you so lost always? Uh, that's right. Um, it's like that one sound effect. They've got like four noises they make, that one. I feel like it wouldn't be too hard to navigate into here. Um, now that we've got all of our beacons down. Oh, sorry. I'm trying to follow the river up more than... Um... Oh my god, it's that. Oh, is the poop gate under us? Oh, is this like the tree? Oh no, it's just rocks. <laughs> it's always gonna be funny. Like, literally, always gonna be funny. Um, how are you guys doing? Boom! Get out of here! Okay, maybe that was a bit unfair. Oh, uranium! Oh! You guys get out of here as well. Uh, I really want uranium, but I'm really injured, so... Oh, fuck, it's full. And it's not even uranium, it's uranite. One, two, three. Uh, because if we can... Like, the surface base seems pretty chill with the bioreactor. If we can pack up the bioreactor, bring it down here, suddenly infinite stuff we get not infinite well there's tons of uranium or uranite uh loads of random metals very cool uh there's blood vines i guess we just have to bring down some like plants and shit to actually plant i'm actually really getting on board with this fuck we could even go over to the Lava caverns, and, um, oh, we've been here before, um, except like thermal, but I kind of, oh shit, uh, um, there you go, alright, you like to EMP me, well I've got the reverse of EMP, just tons of electricity. This is another hole down. Maybe this is like the 
Oh. Oh, it saved the name. That's cool. Floating island hole. Okay, there's the surface. That way's home. We're a long way from home. But if we go in the dark, how much trouble can we really get into? Like, realistically, how much trouble? I'm not even going to look for wrecks. Um, I feel like if we do anything now that might get us into trouble, I'm only going to be super sad. I will activate my um, electro shocks, though, just in case. And... Hooray! God, it is that the Bloodborne Moon again. Sometimes cause, or is it Cosm? Man, it looks amazing. Man, it's a really nice texture. Good work. Whoever did the texture on that, that planet, that moon, um, really nice. Really like it. Very spooky. Very, like, atmospheric. Like, that's a nice, like, screenshot. Like, the crashed spaceship in the sea, the, like, the fucking big moon. Oh, my boys, how you doing? Oh, for the a split second I was thinking about shocking them, but they... They've been nothing but friendly and chill to me this whole time. They don't get fucking stabbed, do they? Maybe they got stabbed a little bit when I first met them, but... They don't get stabbed now, um, like the other guys. I think that's just gonna be the strat. Like, if we see a big guy, we're just gonna go out of way to kill it. Um, and then I can't be scared of them. Like in the Call of Cthulhu role-playing game, um, I'm not sure if you're familiar with that, you lose sanity by like seeing weird monsters and like spooky, spooky creatures and things like that. Um, and, like, losing all your sanity, very bad. It's about, like, losing all of your health. But if you kill, like, you know, mythos creatures, then you slowly regain your sanity because you... The idea is that, like, you well, realize that, you know, they are flesh and blood in a, a form. They can be, can be beaten. Uh, and I think that is the effect that killing those boys is having on me. I'm suddenly now a bit more, like, a bit more in on it. Oh, we should get, like, some spotlights or something. Oh, it feels nice to be back home. Oh, like a fresh, fresh cold one. Ready and waiting. Delicious. I guess Inv is very full. We should probably just clear out the stuff. God, the Reginalds. Man, they are, like, meaty boys. But we do not need <laughs> that much meat. We need, um... The other good stuff. How you guys doing? I had a great adventure. Oh my god, you'd be so impressed. I put down beacons. And then I, um, I sailed around. I killed two, two of the spooky ghost boys. I know, right? And, uh, yeah. Now I'm back. Um, I also got some new materials. Never seen them before. It's great. Sorry, were you still talking? Honestly, listening to you is like dragging my gel sack across okay. glass. If you're if you're gonna if you're gonna be like that, then I'll show you what happens. I'll show you what happens. Boom. Goodbye. That's what where the disease fish go into the tank. Oh, uh, we're hungry. We could go and eat a Reginald, like thin their numbers out because there are a lot of them. Oh, I kind of got stuck on the ladder. Hello, come with me. I have been chosen. Farewell, my friends. I go on to a better... Yum, yum, yum. Chomp. You make me fucking sick. What were we building with crystal stuff? None of you. Okay, nickel is what we need. Crystalline sulfur. Prawn. Jumpsuit. But we need nickel. Man, just still don't have that. Uh, propulsion cannon, grapple arm, torpedo arm. Uh, we can make torpedoes. A kind of, like, vortex torpedo? Doesn't mm. sound great. Gas torpedo. Maybe that's great. How about you? Nickel and stuff. God, wow, we really didn't need all of that crystalline things. Right, if we drop it, if we scan it, will that help? Crystallized sulfur. It's a highly reactive, non-metallic element usually found in abundance underground. Common applications include acidic, acidic compounds and combustibles. Oh. 
I bet I'm going to be using that to fuel the spaceship. Crystalline sulfur, fire suppression system. Oh, uh, what was the other thing we could make? Sonar, computer chip and magnetite. We literally built an extra computer chip because we are uh, bad, at, bad at games. Uh, it was all part of the plan. Oh, Cyclops sonar upgrade. You get plugged in this side. Bonk. Okay. Okay, right. When I first saw sonar, won't lie, I thought it was going to give me a tiny little heads-up display, a bit like you get on the the Sea Glide. I was like, how useful is that going to be? Actually, God, this is really good, especially at night time. God, does it really go through the power, though? Oh, it does. It uses like a percent. Wow, you gotta be fucking careful with that bad boy. Oh, man, having uh, Fisto parked like just outside of here, behind my desk, that's kind of fun. I kind of feel like maybe we'd move this and put it the other way around. Like, sit in a room with, like, your back to the door. I don't know. I could kind of like to be able to see the door. Um, but, uh, you know, we're underwater. How many people are turning up? And if anyone turns up on the base, then the robot will tell us. They'll be like, greetings, random stranger. Uh, guns were banned during the riots of uh, Eroticon 4. And I'll be like, oh shit, they've got a gun. Uh, and I guess last of all, um, toy spaceship. Yeah. Pretty good. A pretty good day all round. Man. I feel pretty good about this now. Don't worry about me, my friends. I am free from the tyrant that sweeps over these lands. I am now in fishy heaven, where when I look around I'm starting to think it might be busier here than in the ocean. Press like in memory of all that have been lost in this series. Thanks for watching. Bye.